Hi, I'm Chris. This is Coco. Uh, we're here to answer your question about uh, training treats. You asked if there was an alternative to peanuts and grapes because your burrs are totally used to peanuts and grapes and they don't respond to them as well. Uh, most of the training treats that you buy in the store, um, those, those have particular ingredients in them that the majority of parrots like. Now, as far as individual guys, because all, all these guys are kind of like us, they'll um, like all of them, they'll all eat grapes, but some of them are going to like grapes a lot more than others. Um, they'll all eat oranges and Doritos, but you know, some of them will respond better to others. So it's going to take a lot of you actually uh, trying a few different treats and trying a few different options to see what they respond to the best. So with Coco particularly, his is grapes, obviously, and oranges. In addition to that, he loves Doritos. Um, Doritos and popcorn are a really good uh, training treats for these guys. I usually try to, I break off the tip where there's no kernel, and I use that as the as the treat. And uh, I don't put a lot of butter on it or anything like that, just plain popcorn. Uh, Doritos, they're good. Um, anything that's got a little bit of peanut butter in it, you know, just none of the stuff that we talked about on the other videos. Um, uh, and again, the training treat, you want to find something that they respond to well and keep that a training treat. Don't give it to them as a, oh, I love you so much, here, have this. Have a separate set of treats for that. Like, let that be grapes or something, something nutritious for their diet, something to keep in a regimen and schedule in addition to your rewarding training treats. You're coming in and out of frame here. You see yourself? Wave to you too. Hey. Hey. Hi. You want to say hi? Who's going to wave? High foot. All right. So anyway, uh, good luck with that. Keep your questions coming. I hope that helps. If not, uh, oh. A few other options. Check on, uh, uh, see how they do with uh, noodle foods, like not anything cooked al dente or anything less. It, it has to be cooked good and, and mushy, um, like a lasagna, um, just regular spaghetti, things like that. My guys, they love spaghetti, but of course, like anything else, with any, any creature, you never want to give them too much of anything. So just keep it in moderation and uh, let us know how you do. Um, Obviously, fruits, vegetables, everything, but uh, what is it? Avocados, cherry seeds, you want to keep them away from uh, colas, anything that's got caffeine in it, and chocolate. Um, other than that, let us know how you do, and Coco and I wish you luck. I want a personal note to my subscribers. We're, uh, we're able to keep the birds here. Um, we're going to work on building an outdoor aviary and working between. Uh, letting my guys go to my mom's aviary, who's local, and my dad's at the beach. So we're, uh, we're working things out there. And anyway, I appreciate the comments and questions. Keep them coming. And uh, have a good day. Bye-bye.